Most people think having high FPS or low input delay requires an expensive PC, but I'm here to prove you wrong. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you important tweaks that will optimize your PC for much better FPS. We're going to be starting with basic Windows tweaks. If your system is already tweaked, please skip to this timestamp. If you want to fully optimize your Windows setting, then don't skip this. So what you want to do first is you want to search View, Add Advanced, system settings and you want to click it once you're over here you're going to look at performance you're going to click settings if you want the best performance what you want to do is you want to click adjust for best performance but personally i like smooth edges and screen font and show thumbnails instead of icons on after that you want to just click apply and okay after that you want to go into settings you want to search game game mode settings and you want to make sure this is on and you want to come into graphics if you look down and you see advanced graphic settings make sure you turn on hardware accelerated gpu scheduler but if you don't see this option is perfectly fine it just means your system doesn't have it so once you're over here you want to click add desktop app and then you want to find your fortnite game and you want to add it this one is the fortnite game not any of these two once you add it it should pop up down here once you're in here you want to see gpu preference and you want to click your graphics card after you do that you should see on your side apps you want to click it and then you want to click installed apps you want to go through this list and delete any apps you don't need so okay so what you want to do first is you want to join my discord server in the description then you should start on this channel and what you want to do is you want to click this green check mark after you click this green check mark you want to click free tweaks right here you want to click video resources after you click it you want to download this after you download it you should see this file and what you want to do is you want to click it and you want to click extract all after you extract it all it should create a new file all you need to do is click it and for the first optimization this is only for nvidia users if you're on amd please skip to the next optimization but if you're in nvidia stick around so what you want to do is you want to double click on this folder you want to right click on this you want to click run as administrator you want to come over here to profiles you want to delete this you want to search up Fortnite or the game you're playing. After you search it up, what you want to do is you want to drag the XNet free settings into here. But I'm not going to do that because I have my premium settings. After you do that, it should be optimized and go to the next setting. Okay, for, so for the next setting, what you want to do is you want to double click on this button. And then you want to click Windows and R. After you click Windows and R, run should pop up. And what you want to do is you want to type percent local app data and click ok once you do that you want to click on any of these files up here and then you want to click f once after you open it up you want to click save you want to click config windows client and then you should see these game user settings and then what you want to do is you want to just swap them out so you're just going to drag it over here and then you're just going to click replace file on this destination after you do that you want to just go back and then you want to click on mouse and keyboard tweaks all you have to do is you just want to right click on this and then just click run as administrator and click yes after it opens it's just going to automatically do all the tweaks then what you want to do is you want to type your cpu in the comments below i'm going to be telling you if it's high end mid end or low end personally i have a mid end cpu so I'm just gonna click two and it should just complete the operation after that that should be done and just close out the program then what you want to do is you want to double click on this and then open auto runs what you want to do is you want to go into log on and disable everything that you don't need make sure not to disable anything that you don't know because you could disable something that you need in order for the computer to run but after you do that just click exit you don't need to save and then go back open this folder and all you need to do is double click which is open you should just select what you want out of your thing i recommend like selecting everything because obviously it isn't needed then just click ok and delete files after that it should automatically close and all you need to do is you want to right click on your and then go down to windows icon shut down or sign out and just restart your computer 